Hello, this is Christovar, and well, I figured I'd, I'd do one of these videos, one of those videos of where, where were they, where are you, where were you, where were you, where are you, where, where was Christovar, Christovar, where were you, I don't know, something like that, um, I, feel I don't really need to explaining, because, you know, it's all, it's, YouTube and all that, but you know, I, just in case of the one or two, one or two people that uh, watch my videos, uh, care or anything, I don't know. I just figured I'd do some sort of little rant video. It's not necessarily a rant, but it's just, you know, what's on my mind and stuff like that. And while I do that, I'll go through uh, some of the cards of my collection here so you'll have something to look at while I'm talking. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> you tell I'm in a I'm in a I'm in a good mood today. It's a nice had a nice little Saturday. Went to the LCS. This is still the um Air National International Sports Car Day. So yeah, I'm making a couple videos in the same day, but this one won't. I guess I guess I'll just post set this one to post Monday. What what the heck? I think Monday, Sunday or Monday, I don't know, whatever. Cause uh I have to spread them out a little bit because if not then you know, people might miss them if you post like a whole bunch of year, like more than one in a day or something like that. You know, you have to let your videos breathe a little bit. You know, I'm also a little cautious about, you know, even posting like the next day because to let my previous video, you know, get, let it soak a little bit, let people, you know, find it and watch it and all that good stuff. But anyways, I'm getting off the topic here. Um, yeah, so there's that, uh, yeah a little bit of dust there. I guess I should wrap these up in something like a team bag or something. So they, they won't go in a, a thick car sleeve even. Congratulations, you purchased a blaster box of 2022, 2022 Series 2. <laughs> that always cracks me up to congratulate. Oh, there's that guy. What is he batting now? 175, 178. And he's the leadoff hitter for the Phillies. Still in leadoff. Hitting leadoff. He's about 178. Congratulations. That's the end of that rant. I'm not going to tell him how to, how to run their team. I'm sure he knows what uh, Thompson knows what he's doing, but sometimes I just wonder. Ooh, look at that. It's got a king re. Uh, yeah. So, uh, so I went on vacation in man, June, like middle of June. It was the week of Juneteenth. I always remember that because it's easy to remember because the holiday Juneteenth falls on like the 19th or 18th or something like that. And as well as the Father's Day fall, uh, falls on that as well. There's a three of five there for you. And uh, hope he comes back strong. That'd be nice if he comes back. They give him contract extension i don't know his contract was up this year reese's was um yeah i was on vacation and then i came back and made a couple videos i guess of what i had um what i got opened some open some stuff and uh diablo 4 just took over I guess, because I started playing it. I played it on vacation out there. You know, when you're hooked on something, when you take your actual CPU for your PC on vacation with you. So I took my whole c CPU out there and I was down in their basement where we were, where we were staying. And, uh, yeah, I was playing with the, my son-in-law there. It's pretty fun. He, he plays on his either Xbox or PlayStation 5. I think it's PlayStation 5. I believe it's PlayStation 5. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, they, uh, so we played, I was in the basement, he's up there, so we played together, like, most of the week and stuff, because it came out, had come out that week, or the week before, when I was on vacation. And, uh, let's see here. Get through these, oh. Basketball cord. All right, there's Bo, rookie debut card. He's doing pretty good. Yeah, so started playing Diablo 4 when it came out, and then 
foolishly. I don't know why they did this. They had the season come out so soon. They had the season, the season, uh, season one of Diablo four came out just like a month or a month and a half, two months after, after, uh, the game was released. It's kind of weird. It's like, why? I just want to play the regular game. Can I just play the regular game and not have to be, you know, the, uh, in the season already, it's like, come on, I just want to, I want to play the regular, regular game. Lots of Top's Finest Hero. Boom's rookie color. First Moon Flash. Yordan. Hmm, there's an auto of him. <laughs> I don't know <laughs> what that's doing in there. And Manny Machado's rookie card from Prism. 2013, I believe. Yep, 2013 Prism. Manny Machado's rookie card. How about that? Yeah, so then the season came out, and I really started playing it because of the season. Because the season uh, usually has, you know, stuff to that buffs your character a little more, so it's a little more, a little more fun that you can do stuff that you couldn't necessarily do before. Oh, Freshman Flash, Dansby. Hmm. See, there's Wander Franco. Before he was in the major leagues. There's another Wander Franco. His uh, Bowman uh, Chrome. He was still in the... Wasn't in the major leagues yet. Oh, here's... The, oh, the Bryce Harpers. <laughs> I bought a pa pack of like 20 Bryce Harpers for like, I don't know what, five bucks or something. <laughs> hey, whatever. It was one of those the impulse buys. So Bryce Harper, that's funny. And Dwayne Hoskins. I was gonna sell this card, but I don't know for some reason the price dropped dr dras drastically or something, or just wasn't worth it. So I don't know. And then there's another one. Evidently, I bought one on eBay because they were so cheap, like a buck or something. So I was like, well, I'll take that off your hands and I'll sell it later on whenever he does does uh, good a lot good, good better yeah so Diablo 4 base basically and then I just got out of the groove of you know going, coming down and making videos and stuff even though I have I have all kinds of stuff well I just bought this today this um hobby box of panini panini uh hobby box the the traditional 12 cards per pack 12 packs per box looking forward to having that um, yeah, I got that today, and then I have a bunch of, I have a bunch of, uh, hanger pad boxes from, like, a month ago that I bought. Um, yeah, I forget how many I got, like, six or eight of them. <laughs> Rookie Stars, Nick Williams and Reese Hoskins. That's a Chrome, number to nine ninety nine. See, Andrew McCutcheon, there, nice, nice, uh, uh, whatever that's called, the blue thing. There's that. Christian Pache, 23 out of 75. Breaker Bros, remember them? I'll have to catch up with them, see what they're up to. Uh, I know they were doing, they were going live like just about every other day. It was kind of weird. It was like, felt kind of bad for them because they didn't have like a really big following yet. And then they were going live. So it's like they have just, Maybe, I don't know how many people were watching or anything, but whatever. Oh, here's this Chris Bryant rookie card from 2015 Topps Chrome 9.5. That's a keeper. Keeper. And, uh, <laughs> Darren Ruff. It was uh, one of those uh, mystery, mystery boxes or whatever you want to call them. Walmart mystery box or something. <laughs> Whoever got that done. <laughs> BCCG. I guess I'll put these on a separate pile. There we go. Yeah, it's kind of funny. Chris Pache is on the Phillies now. Even though he's, I think he's injured on the injured list. It's kind of ironic. Glad I have that card because it's, he's with the, with the Phillies now. So it's a, Keepa. And then there's uh, Star Quest, Chief Sutley, Upper Deck. I guess that's one of their 
it was like a rare card back in the day. Green, not numbered. It was just a green Star Quest card, I guess. <laughs> Mint ten, I guess. BCCG again. <laughs> that was out of a mystery box as well. And I got this from my friend. Um, oh man, man, it's been so long. It's been so long since I've watched any of his videos. The guy he makes really really cool artwork um he paints like digitally paints um players and stuff really cool um man i wish i remembered his name but he he sent me this because i won one of his contests or whatever or giveaways really really nice acuna there insert out of graded 10 gem mint <laughs> all right Got this here, Overdrive Jerry Clinic. All right, I think that was with the same, same guy, man. See, once you've been away for a little while, you just tend to forget, man. X Fractor, X Fractor, not Super Fractor. Super Fractor is one on one. X Fractor is the checkerboard. Okay, or Prism. So it's Prism. I forget what they call it. Checkerboard, maybe. Maybe Prism calls it checkerboard. <laughs> uh, huh, Pat Burl. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> Mint 9. Top Prospects. 1999 SP Top Prospects. Hmm. And there's the Bryce Harper front leg up card. Rookie card. Near Mint. Seven. All right. Then Carlos Beltran. That's out of a mystery box, but the this one here, my. Uh, oh, geez. My other friend sent it to me. The guy that sends me something just about every couple months. Geez, I am having some brain farts today. Had all the spiel, all the spiel planned out, but it didn't work out that way. Francisco, that's it. His name's Francisco. My my friend Francisco that, you know, sends me stuff. Like, seems like quarter, like every couple months, two, three months, four months. Now these I remember I bought myself because they were really cheap. These Gem Mint 10s. Uh, tops 2016 tops chrome and 2016 tops because i was expecting him to have a pretty monster year this year with the uh, new rolls the new infielder rolls um he was uh, projected to be one of the one of the um, uh, players to benefit the most from the new infield so and i believe he is doing pretty good this year after he came back from his injury he is doing pretty good so there's that. All right. Yeah. All right. Yeah, it seemed like I got into, you know, how people get into a rut and stuff. If they stop, stop doing something for a while, they just become too comfortable or whatever and, and not doing it or whatever. So I just kind of went blah with, with the... The car collecting hobby, it was on hiatus for probably about a month and stuff while I work on my other hobby, which is video games. <laughs> I think took care of, took care of, or took over my life, except for going to work and stuff for the better part of the last month, month and a half. Two months, two months, yeah, because it came out June 1st. I was in the, the pre-release release. I paid the extra whatever, 10 bucks for that as well. I'll probably open this next, the uh, Great Lakes. The GLB Collector's Box. See, they forgot their sticker this year. I mean, this month. And that's the July box. I've had it for a good couple weeks, so it's not their fault. They actually... I've had it for a couple months, and so... Yeah, I'll probably open up that next, because it's been sitting the longest since, like, July. You know, it's dated and all that stuff. I have to... It's July's box, and then... August box will probably come within the next couple weeks already. I know the Collectible Card Club is going to be here probably any day if it's not out in my mailbox right now. Um, 
Yeah, so I'll have the collectible card club as well. And Panini. Excuse me, man. I still have one blaster of this left. 2023 Series 2. And all those, uh, what, rack pack, uh, not rack packs, hanger packs are uh, also Series 2. So we'll see what I get out of that. And then I'll put it all together and see if if uh, how close I got to getting all of the all the base cars at least for from just buying retail um yeah we had to buy a couple things I bought a new Roku we we switch it up we have fire uh, Amazon fire sticks and Roku players for our streaming stuff and we used a Roku in the living room because it's it's you know durable and it's a, a set top box and stuff so it's it's good for having the living room for you know everybody to watch or whatever so our old one was crapping out it was uh it was like whenever you'd be on a menu or something you'd like click down or over to you know select menu things who like go G -g 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 -g, and then just like skip over to like the fourth thing and it was just it was just starting to crap out it was an old one it's several years old so we were due and i got a you know a souped up version the one that has where the remote actually charges so that's going to be really nice as well save money save money there with the um char rechargeable remote because we've been using a lot of batteries because she my wife uses her headphones because we plug it in. she uses the plug-in function because my my office is right around the corner from the living room and then when i'm at work she'll have the tv on but she'll have her earplugs and or whatever so that you know i don't get distracted from the tv and stuff which is which is great i really appreciate her doing that and stuff so that you know i can concentrate on stuff being an accountant and all that stuff um yeah yeah man yeah, yep wow this video ended up being long holy smokes but yeah i didn't go anywhere i didn't really take a break per se i was just doing something else at the time and it was unintended this break was actually unintended i wasn't burned out or anything like that like before and stuff where it was like oh i just it seemed like it was beginning to be a chore before and stuff like that so i was like well i'll be back whenever i'll be back because i just don't feel like it anymore blah 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 now it's like i just i just didn't just i don't know it was just whimsical stuff like uh, i just don't feel like it because i want to i want to get another level one again or level do another du dungeon blah 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 get more gear and stuff like that um <laughs> So, yeah, I hope, hope everybody had a great time. Uh, if you went to the National or not, I don't know. Um, probably too late in the video for to ask that um, if anybody went to the National. I know I really, <clears throat> I really, that's one thing I look forward to every year is watching as many videos as I can of the National to see what, what everybody picked up, what their experiences were, so I can <laughs> live vicariously through them because i can't uh couldn't go this year i may may go next year because it's a little bit closer i forget where it's at. is it in cincinnati or cleveland cleveland it's in cleveland it's a little bit closer so that's doable that's like a day drive from here in Pen central south central pennsylvania um yeah, because I'm used to driving out to Indiana in one day or whatever, so that shouldn't be too bad. That should be like a half a day, really, out there. But Chicago, Chicago is a pretty long drive. Um, I'd have to, like, probably stay at a hotel on the way there, maybe, or something. Or maybe st stop at my wife's family's house and stay there for the night and then shoot up to Chicago the following day or something if I were to go to the the national car show but yeah i really like uh, the videos uh still have a lot to watch because i haven't watched too many uh youtube videos either i mean i've watched what i can so far um and yep live up the expectations it's just evidently it was like the back in the 90s or something somebody said uh so it's, it, it's the hobby is exploding again 
and stuff. So evidently, well, it's got to be because we have a couple shows around here. Well, one's like an over an hour away, but the other one's like up there at the college that I go to. That wasn't here just a couple years ago. I don't think. I don't know. I'd have to look that up. But I just learned about it last year and stuff. I don't even know how I learned about the one down down uh geez down south it's like southeast or something i forget maybe maybe facebook uh uh recommended that page or something and that's how i found that and then they they are partnered with the same company that rents out the college up here that's just 10 minutes away so there's that i guess facebook is good for some stuff when you just don't do it uh, personally when you do it like like uh you know st stuff for your hobby and stuff like a bunch of different facebook groups and stuff like that for baseball anyways i'm starting to rant here oh man so there you go to recap i just got caught up with uh, my other hobby um slash hobbies i do other stuff besides you know collect baseball cards and I just didn't get back to this, and it just snowballed, and that's what happened. And I just didn't make any videos for whatever, however many weeks it's been. Three weeks, two, three, four weeks, whatever. It's not not game-changing, not breaking anything, whatever. My whole tens of views will, will suffice. All ten of you that watched this video, appreciate you. <laughs> <laughs> anyways i will i will uh see you out there i'll try to get back to my other video uh checking out the comments on my other videos uh the last whatever month or so the the last couple of videos i posted i didn't didn't have time to didn't have time to uh check out or respond to you know everybody uh, comments and stuff like that um, but I intend on doing that sometime whenever I have time away time I can do it so so there thanks for watching and I'll see you later <laughs>